Yo, yo, yo! Big Way, representing the Bronx here with another YouTube video for you. Yes, you. Check this out. I've been on this YouTube stuff for quite some time now, and I was fat as fuck, and I'm still losing weight. And I've been trying, and I, I've been on my bullshit, like with the, you know, first, when I first started the intermittent fasting, um, being not aware of the hormonal effects of being older, because this is the first motherfucking time I've been 43 years old. However, um, insulin is a big factor on preventing weight loss. And I went through the veganism, and I still like veganism. I, I believe it's a great tool. All these things are tools. Um, I went through that, and even when I was on a vegan lifestyle for a few months, the weight loss did not come off um, because I believe that my carbohydrates and my carbo uh, and my insulin resistance and my glycogen all weren't doing its thing first. Um, I wasn't depleting my glycogen, which even though I was doing aerobic style activity, the amount of glycogen that you really deplete is not as much as when you're doing resistance uh, exercises. Uh, resistant exercises, body weight, um, isometrics, eccentric, concentric movements that mean pushing, pulling, uh, using weight as, as your degree of depleting glycogen. I was lifting big weight for less reps, so it was not really affecting my muscle glycogen that much. However, since I really got tired of the bullshit, I decided to try other means. And one of the YouTube founders or forefathers, Elliot Hulse, said, try any given thing for a year to see if it works for you. So he made mention of a ketogenic style of eating and also the eat, stop, eat method. I did the intermittent fasting, but again, I don't think I was doing it properly. Now, um, start going back over it again because I heard so much positive things with the intermittent fasting. I decided to go keto first. I did keto underneath Dr. Eric Bird, E-R-C-B-E-R-G. Dr. Eric Bird has put me on, uh, not himself, but listening to his videos was very, very helpful. Doing that, I came to realize eating, like the body goes through ketosis, even if you don't implement much fat. It's just a substrate for your body to use as energy. However, I'm just thinking if you're putting that much fat in your body, even though it's satiating as fuck, um, the cheese, the butter, the cream cheese, and all that other stuff, even though his style of um, the ketogenic diet is kind of helpful and I, I believe it's very health, healthy. But I decided not to go too much of a keto. I do want my carbs, even though I was finding keto recipes for bread and stuff like that that I wanted, it was helpful. So when I decided to deplete my um, glycogen and, and so forth, it helped and along with the ketogenic diet. However, when I started the ketogenic diet and the intermittent fasting, holy shit, the weight loss was freaking dramatic, bruh. Check out my previous videos. You see how fat my freaking face was. Yo, listen, it, it was remarkable. But now I'm going more towards a carbohydrate like maintenance. I'm seeing that not going over 300 grams of carbohydrates, especially if you're doing a resistance style exercise, a full body exercise or isometric movement, you're depleting muscle glycogen depending on how, 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 how long you're underneath tension and stuff like that. I'm finding that that works pretty damn well. So, if you guys want videos on isometrics and the things that I've, I've done to really help my weight loss, comment, like, subscribe. Your boy needs your support. I want to be one of those YouTube channels that helps the community, especially given undulterated some 
knowledge about what I'm doing, the research that I'm doing for your guys to help you because YouTube has helped me and I just want to give back. So, you know, this is what it is, man. Keto is the way to go. Intermittent fasting is the way to go. Veganism is the way to go. These are all tools that you could use to help continue doing big things. I salute y'all. Big weight representing the Bronx here with that YouTube video for you. Have a go. Peace.